trending on Fossil on Radio and Television with Sarah Agon. I'm not alone today. I have MKO All Rounder, a music comedian. Thank you for having me. Thank you for joining us. If Tinubu is not removed, Nigeria should apologize to Miss Yoma and give her her certificate. Aisha Yesufu, human rights activist and social media influencer Aisha Yesufu has reacted to the alleged forgery of Chicago's university certificate, screaming that if Tinubu is not removed, then Nigeria should apologize to Miss Yoma and give her her certificate. Aisha, who stated this via her ex, formerly known as Twitter, added that if we want to be mad as a nation, then let's be proudly mad. Sunday, Igboho regains freedom after two years. Yoruba nation activist Sunday Adeyemo, popularly known as Sunday Igboho, has regained freedom after two years of trial by the Beninian government. Recall that in July 2021, Ibo was arrested alongside his wife, Ropo, in Kotsonu Benin Republic and detained at the request of the Nigerian government. Meanwhile, Aloy Ijimako, the special counsel for Nnamdi Kano, the leader of the indigenous people of Biafra, IPOP, has restated the call for the release of the Biafra agitator. Ejimako asserted that by releasing Kano, Tinibu will effectively bring an end to eight years of persecution under the former president Muhammadu Buhari's administration. MQ All Rounder, you're welcome to Trending Today. Thank you. On Trending Today, we have Aisha Yesufu talking about Tinibu's Chicago certificate, saying that if Tinibu will not be removed, that Miss Yama should also be given her certificates. Ah, I saw Yusufu is talking as an activist that uh, if Tinibu saga that it should not be removed from office, then they should give uh, Miss Yama his own certificate because they all forge certificates. Mm -hmm. Now, that is our own, own opinion. What is happening is that uh, this is a emotional talk. This is a internet talking. We are just talking our own. You understand? But because court, this case of forgery, uh, forgery certificates has to go, go through Supreme Court. It's, it is when the Supreme, Supreme Court admits that uh, evidence and whatever that uh, the court will, the Supreme Court will go over it I and mean, know maybe it will remove Tinubu or not remove Tinubu. Now, as, it's, as it is now, nobody can say decisively that uh, Tinubu should resign or he should do this. It's not it's allegation. It's uh, the allegation that the, the, the certificate is forged. Although we saw the certificate that uh, Ibiya Bola Ahmed Tinubu you understand the one that is submitted to INEC, but the one from uh, Chicago is a uh, uh, Bola Adipune Tinubu. It's, an, it's, a, it's a woman, but our president is a man. We all know our president is a man. But this certificate proved that uh, 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 the woman owned this certificate. But we cannot say, because in this generation now, we know that anything can happen. Woman, they turn to man, and man, they talk to woman. So, if certificate of Chicago is saying that it's a woman, and we have somebody who's using that certificate as a man, what can we do until the Supreme Court verdict? Final verdict. That's when we will know. But as it is now, nobody can say or force a president to resign. Yeah. It, it nobody can force him to resign now. This court is the Supreme Court that we that we, we are waiting for, that we give uh, his own. What credit. do you think about the comparison between Tinibu's uh, uh, certificate with Miss Yoma's certificate? The, the, it's the same for jury. I think the one they brought from Chicago is different from the one it's either in INEC. Mm -hmm. 
You understand? So this human's own has been confirmed to be a fake. This human has been be confirmed to be a fake result. result. Um, the team's yes, own has, has been, been, conf been confirmed. Has been confirmed by we people. You people that he has been confirmed because we saw the certificate from the Chicago, Chicago. we saw the picture, and we saw the the wand uh, with a uh, eye neck. You know, that's, uh, uh, the, the, the character is not the same thing. I mean, the letter, letter type is not the same. Thing. I think it's not, it's, it's but not, you cannot say it's not proper for an individual to on your own confirm a case that is still in the Supreme Court. Yeah, yeah, you can say that. Yes, that's why we are saying that uh, uh, I say you should wait first. That's you right. cannot say categorically that uh, Tinubu should be removed now, or you will remove Tinubu, uh, or the house will remove Tinubu. Nobody can remove Tinubu, and Tinubu will not resign. Thank you. You understand? Until the Supreme Court gives their final give verdict. their final verdict on this case. Thank you. Uh, that is the final that's uh, so we are just agitating, we are just uh, it's a, uh, we are just saying our own. Uh -huh. you but we feel this is we are this is a constitutional government. You understand? We have to follow the rules, the constitution. You understand? And the interpreter of the constitution is the supreme judges. So when the Supreme Court says, Okay, the certificate you are seeing is fake. Oh, it's not speak. Oh. Then we will be able to know the truth about it. All right. Sunday ago regains freedom after two years. Sunday ago is uh, fighting for his people. When the full army ends men that uh, Boris uh, regime brought from uh, Nigel, uh, Chad, Central Africa to Nigeria to come and overthrow them. Uh, uh, Jonathan. Jonathan, but when Jonathan uh, know that uh, okay, I cannot because of my ambition mm. let Nigeria uh, blood split. So you have to surrender to him. No, but after he surrendered uh, the government to Buhari, the people that Buhari brought to Nigeria, they still enter our bush to rape our women, to destroy our farm, to kidnap us, and all. It's still, and this thing is still happening now. So when this thing was happening in the in the southwest, so the Sunday Bruno now came on that. Okay, we cannot sleep like this. That uh, this uh, this thing will be going on in our domain. The Buhari uh, regime, they felt that no, nobody should talk. That Sunday Bruno people should not talk. That's your boss because when uh, uh, when you look at the uh, the, the Sultana. They use the southerner used to agitate talk more. If you see people that are activists agitate, they are from southerner. They not always keep quiet. One thing is happening, especially when the leader is misbehaving. They will keep quiet, but the southerner will not rest. They will be talking. That's why you see Sunday in Bo that time. But Dwari now they want us to silence Sunday in Bo. So they now send DSS to kill Sunday in Bo. But as God may have it, God saved the life of Sunday Ibo. He has to go through Kutono. He wanted to go to Germany. But Buhari has already made a uh, uh, brutal the ambassador to Kutono because of uh, Sunday Ibo. He has said they have to put brutal there. You know, they have planned this is planned. Okay. You know, because me, I confirm uh, Buhari's government as a terrorist government. We've never had this uh, this uh, kind of government in Nigeria before. You understand? So the Sunday Bobo now has to remain. Uh, people advise him to remain in uh, Kuton. You understand? So the Kuton now have given him the freedom, mm. the freedom to to return to Nigeria. Right. In which I thank God for his life, for God saving his life, and again and again. We are now talking about the present government. Oh. Now the Bimini Republic has freed Sunday Ibo to come to Nigeria. You understand? Unamdekano is still in, 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 is still in DSS custody. Yes. The, 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 the court freed Unamdekano, but the DSS, the government, Buhari then, refused to 
are now free to carry on to go. Now, when this new government came, uh, this present government, Bola Tinubu, what people are expecting to Bola Tinubu is to do that, okay, they should let Kano go. But he still refused. They are still doing Akada Dabra. We don't know what they are doing. But what we are agitating for, what we are saying now is that if you free Kano, then you bring peace to Nigeria. Call Kano, call Sibu Boho, talk with them. You understand? On the round table and let peace come back to Nigeria. Now, if you see Southeast now, every day, every Monday, you will see sit at home, sit at home. People are dying. The the economic in uh, that part of the country is so far. You understand? So let the government of Bola Metimu do something. Try to bring peace. Bring peace to by releasing by releasing in Ambicano. Thank you very much. Thank you, all around the music comedian. Thank you for coming to the studio. Thank you, thank you very much. I want you to like and subscribe to our channel. Thank you. Thank you for joining us. Thank you for watching us. Trending on Procyon Radio and Television with Sarah Agua. Keep shining like the star you are.